you are here because you're interested in the Rode Wireless Go, and I happen to be wired up with three of them right now. I actually got four of them, and I've got another one that's hooked up to a GoPro, which I'll show in a separate video. But I've got currently here one, two, three, and they're all connected here to my Zoom F4. Let's have a look at how awesome these things really are. When you see me on these shots here, this is actually the Rode Wireless Go going directly into my Canon 5D Mark IV. That's why the audio sounds a bit different. Greetings folks, my name is Jason McNamara. I am here in Tokyo, I'm in Shinjuku. You've got the really, really awesome camera store here, Yodobashi Camera, there's a bunch of other stores behind me. This is like, if you're a camera person, you come to Tokyo, this is one of the best districts to go to. We also have another store called System 5, which is a little bit out of the way. Very, very cool store. The manager there who I met the other day, Arai-san, actually speaks a bit of English, which was really cool. Uh, there's another big camera store, uh, sorry not big camera, Yodabashi here, there's another big camera just around there, really cool place to go. But the reason I'm here is because I'm currently wearing three Rode Wireless Go systems. So let's have a listen to the audio difference because I can switch through. The Rode Wireless Go, the Rode Wireless Go, the Rode Wireless Go, the Rode Wireless Go. Stop! If you're not wearing your headphones, put them on because seriously that section you just heard is going to sound so much better through headphones if you're listening to it through an iphone or computer speakers forget it headphones here we go again the road wireless go the road wireless go the road wireless go the road wireless go what you are hearing right now is this particular wireless go here which is the wireless go without a microphone attached because as i'm sure you've seen wireless go videos already it's got a microphone built in and i'm wearing what they call the dead kitten everybody just keeps saying oh, this thing on here it's called a dead kitten because as we know it's called a dead cat with the big one and road being the funny australians that they are called it a dead kitten for the little one then uh that's the sound of that now we'll go across to one with a lav mic and this has the Wireless Go lav mic, which is an optional extra mic that you can buy as well, which is the one sitting here on my uh, right-hand side, your left, I guess. And then, if we go across here, this is the microphone that you can buy as a lav, which is the uh, Rode Link lav system. So this is the highest end one that they do. Personally, I think it sounds really, really cool like that. They all work for their own purposes. If I just quickly, just for the sake of letting you hear the difference, let's take off the dead kitten. And that's what it sounds like without the dead kitten on there. Now, I've got a buddy with me here named AJ who's gonna come on these videos. Hey, what's going on, guys? Hey, folks, this is AJ. How you doing, mate? Yeah, I'm all right, man, nice to see you again. Likewise, yeah, thanks for coming yeah, out. Man. We did some funny videos together with a Trump impersonator who goes by the name of McTrump. We went to Osaka. Oh, yeah. And yeah, we went to Osaka, that was a long shoot. It was a very, it was <laughs> like two days of just flat out busy from start to finish, it was Weltering insane. Heat, yeah. But it was funny as hell, so I'll put a link up in the corner for this video. Now, you can hear him talking because he'll be picked up from here, so let's isolate, just chat, just. Hey, check, 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 how's it doing? You do look like a nerd, by the way, you got the whole. Oh, dude, I know, because I want to monitor and hear it. I, I love it, it's I'm, so good. I'm uh, nerdy as hell, but yeah, you're a man. filmmaker too, so you know what it's yeah, like. Yeah, dude, I'm, I love this stuff, so I'm, I'm really into the sound equipment, so. Uh, be sure to check out AJ's channel. Yeah, Aver Hamilton for all that, A-V-E-R Hamilton. You can catch me in a lot of different stuff. Uh, I stream, I'm on Instagram, Facebook, and website. Everywhere. Everywhere. It's Aver Hamilton. So if I switch across now to my lab here, you can hear me really well, but can you speak again? Yeah, sure. Um, what do you want me to say? I just wanted to catch even that, just so yeah. we can hear the difference. Now I'll go across to the regular, uh, the wireless Go, or I should say the Lav Go mic. So now let's have a listen to that. Oh yeah, look at that. The levels on that are sexy. Yeah, well, man, that's the zoom for you. Oh, but it's great. It's we great. just love gear. We're nerds. <laughs> I love gear, man. Um, now, we're also going to do a separate test again, which you didn't even know I did. I actually went to the Yodobashi store just here behind me oh, yeah? and actually bought an adapter so we can try it on an iPhone as well. Oh, really? Oh, really? we got to get out of the way because he wants to drive right. past. Okay. We'll be back in a sec. Yeah, guys. This part here you're about to see looks terrible because I just filmed it quickly on my iPhone 10. It's directly out of the phone. It was grainy as hell. I increased the uh, brightness on the phone just to be able to see. It looks shit, to be honest, but it's all about the sound and the sound is really cool. So. When you watch this part, just keep that in mind. We are here with the Rode Wireless Go system. Now, we're in Tokyo. We're just in front of the Metropolitan Building here, and you can see there's some sort of a crazy event going on behind us. It's a dance thing with a bunch yeah, of kids yeah, dancing. Dance event of some sort. So what we're going to try and do is, because we've got stereo bikes, we're going to go one on either side of the people here, and we're going to let you hear the stereo image of how you can catch it in the field using two of these. Let's go have a look. Hi. 
So if you're looking for a creative way to use your wireless Go, that's pretty creative, huh? Yeah, yeah, it's pretty nice, man. This thing's sleek. I love it. Super, super tiny, super easy to use, and the cool thing is you have two of them, you can make a stereo image out in the field, hence why I'm wearing my headphones, so I can make sure it's all sounding good, which it is, it's great. <laughs> yeah. The foot walking thing that AJ and I did here is honestly not perfect because he's wearing sneakers or runners as you may call them. We're on a bitumen ground. We didn't have many leaves and stuff to rustle through, but still the concept is there. So I hope you enjoy this section. We have a bit of a fun setup here. I'm currently shooting on a GoPro Session 5. I've got the app set up here. This man's gonna do a little bit of walking with his shoes. You can see he's got a couple of uh, road wireless goes on each foot. And we've got the Canon over here on the Ronin. And what we're going to do with this is he's going to walk and uh, <laughs> this is going to be a bit of fun. So we're going to show you a really cool use of getting Foley without having to worry about going through redoing it later. So can you stand in front of the cannon for us? All right, facing you. Yes, please. All right. And that's what it looks like when he's facing me. Now we're going to do three tests here. We're going to do like this so that they're clipped on with the uh, cold shoe mount. He's clipped onto his front laces. Then he's going to turn around the other way and we're gonna clip them to the back. And then we're also gonna try it with them inside of his socks. So you can see here what I've done is I've clipped them onto the back of his shoes via the little tag that you use to pull the shoes on. The left hand mic is pointing outwards the right hand mic is pointing outwards and we're going to go for the same sort of test. And lastly they are now inside of his socks so let's give this a go. Get experimental with your wireless go because it's cool what you can do. As you saw, we didn't really have the greatest of conditions because the ground was very smooth, AJ had runners on, but the idea is still there. Get experimental with your wireless go because it's cool what you can do. AJ and I are back again and we're filming on the iPhone. I'm still wearing my mic, he's still wearing his mic, but he's filming me, I'm filming him, so that you can see that right now there's nothing plugged into there. This little monster here is made by Rode. It is called the SC6. So the inputs on here are TRRS and a stereo headphone output. The way this works is a special cable which has a black end, which has a regular TRS, and has a gray end, which is a TRRS, through a lightning cable adapter with your iPhone. So as you can see there, I've got two of them plugged in side by side. Now here's a neat little trick because of course, you're gonna be going, well, how the hell am I gonna do this? It's all just hanging around and blah, blah, blah. I got a fun little trick I discovered. The two cold shoe mounts, you just put them into each other like that and they stay perfectly together. If I was really organized, I would find something just to tape it to the back or somehow do it, uh, turn the cables around the other way and what have you and just get them sorted. But I'm just doing this on the fly. I literally just bought these from the store that I started this video at this afternoon. So now here we are and you should be able to hear much better audio quality this time. Yes, I think so. So you can see Hopefully. on the back here, I'm holding the two of them in there. I've got that there. It's not really a cumbersome setup. This is a great way to get awesome audio because it sucks using regular audio. People love using their iPhone. Yeah. Um, you know, you just carry a wireless Go system. It's very, very small inside of the pouch that it comes included with, which I'll put an image on the screen now for you to see. I think it's probably the best solution you can have for creating content on the fly that needs to be high quality. Nobody gets sound right. And that's exactly what it is. You can have the greatest, I say this all the time, the greatest shot video in the world, but if your sound sucks, your video sucks. Yep. That's all there is to it. Yep, I've done that many a times. <laughs> I've edited a shit sound quality video and everything else was funny. The sound is so bad, none of the jokes delivered. So that's it. And that's exactly what it is. Sound so, is important, y'all. Hell it's yeah. Important. I hope you enjoyed that. If you want to check out this video on this side, this is using your wireless Go with your GoPro. Check out the video on this side. It's amazing what it does when you use your iPhone with a wireless Go. It's insane. There's some really cool stuff there. So please check them out. Thanks for watching. Please like the video, leave a comment, all that good stuff. See you soon.